What's going on YouTube? Snaps here with TKO Gaming bringing you guys another video of the Destiny 2 beta. Now, before we get into the video and talk about not only the new survival playlist announced for the Destiny 2 beta, we're going to talk about how Destiny 2 has the potential to be the best freaking game in the world and yes, better than Destiny 1. Coming from a player who loves Destiny 1, who played the shit out of Destiny 1 and a lot with you guys. So thank you guys for being a part of that journey. Now, let's quickly get into something that I need to get off my chest really really fast my grandmother was in the hospital over the weekend this last weekend that's why there was no videos no gaming for me at all i was in the hospital in a suit and i'm very very thankful that she is getting better so thank you guys for the concern the condolences the love all the beautiful people in the world even the people that maybe wanted something bad to happen i love you remember that snipes loves you damn it but most people were all love and kind and i love you guys for that thank you so let's get into this really fast so the new survival game mode that's coming out in the destiny 2 game now we won't be able to play it in the beta we also won't be able to play it in the pc beta but it will be out when destiny 2 launches now bungie is going to pretty much set aside two playlists one a casual playlist and one a competitive playlist now the casual playlist is going to be like control gameplay right that type of stuff like quick play and then what you have in the competitive is countdown and survival now we got a little taste of countdown a lot of fun it's like search and destroy could use a couple tweaks i talked about it in my last video if you guys want to check it out please do so and then you have survival now what survival is is it's going to be a pretty cool game it kind of resembles skirmish and destiny one but with a limited number of lives now keep in mind all playlists in destiny 2 will be 4v4 so essentially what you have is 4v4 on one map with one power weapon in the middle and eight lives per team your initial live will not count but think about it that's two team wipes and that's it you're done so that's pretty cool i think that'll be pretty awesome to even go forth and play it has a little bit of a skirmish trials of osiris feel to it i will be interested in what it will do now granted the one power weapon in the middle is going to be a focal point for everybody to go and get if you keep in mind this is really hinting on the way halo used to be and remember now in my eyes and probably in a lot of your eyes as well Halo was the best franchise series game ever made and Destiny is definitely competing against it. I think it goes all the way up to Halo 3. Some would even put Halo Reach in that bunch, but me, Halo 1, Halo 2, Halo 3, nothing beats those, period. Bungie is connecting back with their roots when it comes to the beauty of competitive gameplay. Now, keep in mind, I think that I'm a little bit right now more excited about the PvE aspect with the whole Gaul and the Legion and all that beautiful stuff in Destiny 2, but Bungie has a chance to make this so great for both casual players and competitive players. This little competitive playlist, I love it, but why don't we add a ranking system have it replicate the Halo 2 ranking system or Halo 3 ranking system. I know it's going to have some bad things that come along with it. Most of you know what those are. But a lot of great things will come along with it as well. And it will make the game last that much longer. Especially in times with limited content while we wait for another DLC to drop. Now guys, I love the fact that Bungie is really focusing on primary gameplay. That's exactly what Halo did. Power weapons were really limited in Halo series and they're doing it once again in Destiny. I like it a lot. Supers are not too big of a factor in Destiny 2. I really do like it. However, I feel like in PvE and raids, supers shouldn't matter as much. But hey, it will bring out the skill and more teamwork for everybody on the team going forward. I do believe the Hunter needs to get a little bit more buffed compared to the other classes, especially in the super game. But we'll see. Remember, it was just a beta. A lot of good things are going to come. The gameplay of Destiny 2 does seem a little bit slow paced, but it really does call for more team shot engagement. I would personally like to see more one on one engagement in the game. It feels like I'm getting team shot left and right. Maybe we're playing against like amazing people. Yeah, everybody in the game is great, right? So anyway, we saw a little gameplay of the Altar of Flame, which was the survival gameplay. Got me excited for the game. I know you guys are excited for the game as well. 
we're going to be playing on all consoles xbox playstation and pc uh the youtube should kick back up the stream should kick back up all the beauty and everything is going to just come back and uh hopefully you guys are there with me make sure you guys follow on all of our social media if you haven't i really want to get connected with you guys and keep you guys updated mainly on the twitter for sure so all links are in the description below if you need to see that if you're new to the channel please do hit subscribe it doesn't really cost you anything obviously but it does bring you to a channel filled with a family loving mentality i've met some great people throughout destiny one and i cannot i cannot cannot wait for all the people that i'm going to meet in destiny 2 now destiny 2 this is just the beginning and we're already seeing such a promising future and it really does call for the potential for this game to be the best game ever made in the freaking world and let's hope to that cheers to everybody let's have a great start to destiny 2 it's like what six weeks away man i'm hyped i love you guys so much we'll see you in the next video snipes is out for now stay blessed y'all peace out